What is up, everybody? It is Nathan Green back again. Now, this, th as you can tell, we are playing Spyro. Now, I'm sure y'all have already seen gameplay of it, but take content. So, hello, Nestor. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. Balloonist. What about nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Judging by his size, you'd think he'd have a deeper voice. Like, I don't know why. If it just feels like he should have a deeper voice. And... Woo! Honestly, I really love playing this game because of his little attitude. Damn. And for some reason, I've never done this with any other games, but... I I'm a try hard at this. I'm literally a try hard at this game because I want to complete every single bit. Even with Crash, I'm not this hard at trying. I still can't. I. Just because I want complete this. Oof, Delbin! I think that's open. Yep, Delbin! I like Delbin. Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch him! Keep your horns on, Spyro! See, this is you what I'm talking about. First. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Uh his name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Okay, I will. Thank you, Delby. Now, in the last world, Nasty's world, I do not know why they reappear. Need to get my little uh, timer out. And I'll say I've been doing this for 55 minutes so far. The 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 nah. ah. uh. Anyway, sunny flight. Woo! Barrel rolls. Woo! Now, I like these because they provide a bit of a challenge. See, how I do it is I do the ring, the arcs first. Then, after, I do whatever is next. <laughs> it's easier for me because I find that the easiest way. Ah! ah, damn it. Yes, yeah, six out of eight arches, one out of eight planes. Eh, fair enough. To be honest, I haven't played this in a long time, so. Every time I die or crash, I always retake. Try different routes because that way I can keep things interesting but then again I'd still just go back to the arches spy the dragon spy the dragon 
I don't know. I saw a glitch video, and the guy was singing that. He got into my head with it, too. Ah, dang. Now, the barrels, I'm not too concerned about. Because... Oh crap. Maybe I should be concerned. Yay, a double time. Now where's that last plane? I need a fish fry. Oh, schnitzel. This is going to be a close one. Like, very close. Oh, that scared me. That was too close come for comfort. See, go in the opposite direction of them. And bam. You'll get it. Returning to the artisans. I, l I like artisans. Don't know why. I just do. Alright. Whoop! 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 Fly! And Woo Yeah yeah mm. Okay apparently I already got the gems up here So hmm I don't like how they're just staying there So now see I go I don't know what's with me but I always do sunny flight then Stone Hill next. Like, is that some sort of... Like, uh, What's the word? I cannot think of the word. And no, it's not bird. Because everyone... No, everyone knows the bird is the word. Ah, uh, I don't like this one. Mainly cut. You hear that little <laughs> That's the sound of that little blue little egg thief up there. I really don't like him in town square. Because if you mess up on getting him, you have to to do all that stuff again. You'll see what I mean. Ah! I don't know how to, I don't know how to drive this thing. But I do know the to see. Linda Oh, when hey. you free a dragon or step on one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. That could be useful if you run into trouble. Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. I feel like that was sarcasm, too. Like, I legit feel like that was sarcasm. Hey, it's another goat. Ah, ah! Yay, an extra life. And hello, Astor. After you've freed all the dragons, pass through this fancy vortex uh, thingamajigger. It'll take you back to the artisan home. But first, let me tell you a story. No thanks. See ya! <laughs> no thanks. 
See ya! Now if I remember... Yeah! I remembered correctly. Yay, I got a key. And now I don't know exactly where the key is. Yay. By the way, we're gonna drop down. Drop down. Now you know where the key is and where the chest is. You're welcome. Hey, Gavin. Watch the dragonfly, Spyro. His color indicates his power. When he eats butterflies, he stays strong, like me. Uh, sure. I wonder what he was drinking. Like coffee, tea. Like, what? That's. God, I hate that laugh. It always bugs me. <laughs> I'm a charging bolt. Okay, I I think that's all the gyms around here. I'm not sure. But I do know that there's this guy. Gildas. Spyro, my friend. How about a hint on gliding? You bet. For the longest glide, press the jump button at the top of your jump and try pressing the action button to drop down mid flight. Thanks for the tip. Oh, the dragons are found. Oh, well, at least I still got the gems to find. And the skill point here. That's right, folks. There's a skill point. If I can. Burn that little pink flower. That's the skill point. Now, I really hate these guys. Because... I, I especially hate them in the sec... No. In the third one. Because they will get on your nerves. Especially one part. And I think that one... It's the Tiki Lodge. Yeah. In the Tiki Lodge on the third one... In the third game, man, they will just annoy the hell out of you, man. Like, that ain't even a joke. That's, that's straight up true. Like, I, ah! I, I can't, I cannot jump. What the? Oh, and also, another tip about Sparks. Well, for me, I'm playing PlayStation. So, if you press the, down the left analog stick, he will point towards gems. Which, honestly, you're gonna... Oh my, every time! Like, every single time. I miss a gem. That is what I use sparks for. In case I miss a gem. So I can easily just find it. That is really useful for the other games as well. So there you go. If you don't know where, if you're a tryhard like me and you want to find all the gems, 
use Sparks. He'll help you out. Especially when you're really stumped. Bird, baby, bird. Now, during this series, like, I am gonna be doing the Spyro series. So, first, Arcus. Cool flash! Do that again! <laughs> the artisan's boss is through a portal behind me. You can challenge him now, if you feel you are ready. Now, like I was saying, during this series, I will be doing the boss last. Because, eh, why not? Bear go over here first. And I'll be on my way there anyway, so. Ah! Maze! Maze! Yay! Like, I know this it really isn't a maze. But it kind of... It, okay, we're going to the dark... I didn't catch the last thing. Dark Hollow. Okay, there we go. And I got time, man. And I got time for days. The one thing that really ticks me off about the other two games is that little bear. Yep. Hmm. Bye. I was not playing your games. Yeah, yeah. Jump, jump, jump. Damn it! Keys, man! I need keys! Ooh. Nasty. Hey. It's Alban! Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint their metal armor is fireproof. But a charge attack will take care of them. Why would they not bother you? But like that kind of gets me. Why? Why would they not bother him? Yeah, that's how I do it. Oh, how did this one escape me? Like, legit, I don't know how he escaped me. Timber! Woo! Yeah. So intimidating. And hello, Oswin. Wanna know a secret? Use the action button when you want to zoom in and look around. Oh, your secret's safe with me. <laughs> well, that's a little live now. <laughs> if it's a secret, yet everyone knows it. Just been sure I didn't miss any. Press action button. Uh, action button? The, ah! Ah! Literally, I've been playing this game and I forgot how to do this stuff. What? Every place needs a fire. Darn it. Ah! Okay. That's mo much better. 
Life. Ah! Jeez, I keep on getting knocked down. Eh, yeah, might as well get this one too. I almost forgot about the ch lock chest. I, jeez. And and the key icon is literally so big. Yay, gems. Wait, there's only a hundred here. Yeah, there's some. Yeah, there's only a hundred here. Huh. Then where's the rest? I think I know where. Yep. Darius. Big enemies like this north <laughs> with the club cannot be charged. But a quick flame. That should defeat them. The dragon Shakespeare er, Shakespeare, everybody. Yay, time to go home. <laughs> I was also a little afraid because <laughs> of that number. L like, that'd be seriously messed up. Anyway, now that we got the Dark Hollow, ugh. there's only two places, l one place left before the boss. Hey, Thomas. Hey, Spyro. Press the jump button twice to glide. And, and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. <laughs> oh, that. Best way to get rid of them is just flame the heck out of them. That ought to do the job real quick. Now I'm can't... progress saved. Now, if I'm not mistaking, there is a skill point in town square I think it has something to do with the bowls like I said I'm a try hard for this game for some reason so I must have it and I can get that when I get back and I've only been doing this for like what half an hour now a little less than half an hour and honestly this is pretty cool I mean I barely get time to do this kind of stuff I kind of miss it or just talk play games and have fun who wants roasted chicken mmm fried chicken um, I just remembered something. Me, when me and my friends, we're, we're nerds, so we play D&D. Anyway, we met a Golden Sphinx. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Begin exploring by gliding to that area with the bulls. Use the right stick to get a good look. Anyway, as I was saying, we we are nerds, so we play we play D and D. 
We met a golden sphinx. And the first thing my friend Colin says is he looked up at the at the sphinx with a hungry look in his eye and says chicken I literally slapped I, I slapped him for that like you just told a golden sphinx chicken Thanks, Spyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing the jump button at the very top of your jump? How did he know Spyro was coming to rescue him? Like the cake. Yeah, that's the egg thief. I was talking about the annoying little cracker. Who doesn't love frosted chicken? Whoa. Now, the reason why I'm charging all the bulls is because that's the skill point. Charge all the bulls. Spyro, do you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief, and he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run, run. <laughs> I'm getting a little winded. Hmm. My question is, what a what animal was that? Was that chicken or what? Dang it. See, this is what I was talking about. If you mess up, you gotta do all this again. So you gotta have, like, a tight formation on, like, the wall. Or make sure you're at the... See, see this? This is what I'm telling you about. It is annoying as heck. You got this is one of the th least things I like about it. Cuz if you mess up, you got to climb back up the stairs and retry. And I've already checked there is no other way to get up there. So, if you don't make it, just keep retrying. And since I'm a tryhard... Okay, on these I say screw the gems. Go for the... Yes! Yes! Hala! Wait, did I get... Yeah, I got that. See, that jump, if you don't get him when he does that, he'll jump back up. And by the way, if you want to get that other dragon up there and the skill point, I'm sorry to say, you gotta do it again. That's why I hate this part because if you're a tryer like me you gotta do it okay plus at the end you're gonna have to 100% it if you want to get into the final level nasty's loot and when I say that this you have to 100% it 
to get to the bonus level. I know, it's seriously messed up. See? Skip point done. It's a spinner! Oh my god. What? Hey, Thor. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. You can always check your progress by accessing the guidebook through the pause menu. Thank you. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me. No. No, God. Damn it! I'm a gyard. I must get the gems. I'm locating all the gems. See, cause that that makes me unhappy. Okay. Okay, there, now we can go home. Because now that that little cracker jack is over. Home! By the way, after you, like, charge the bulls, all of them, I think you'll get the skill point, then it's okay to flame them. Like, that's what I know so far. Oh! Can't forget this one. Now, I'm gonna get the gems from the... by the balloonist first. Then... We'll go to the boss level. See, here's the balloonist. Anyway. Wait. What? Okay, it's over here, so. There we go. Toasty. Now, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna... I'm gonna beat Toaster. Then end the video. Because... That'll give some more content. Also, watch out for the dogs. And there is no fodder! So, if you die, <laughs> you die. <sighs> ah! Uh-oh. There goes Sparks. Best way to get them? Flame, charge away, flame again. Oh, I messed up that. Ah! Ah! Holy crackers, jacks. Run away! <laughs> I'm telling you, when you don't have sparks, this is intense. Oh, ah! 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 
Okay, so... Round two, here we go. Because we're reigniting. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna go bother with this. I mean, if I already killed them, I'm, I'm just gonna... Rush past them. Woo! Okay. Whew. Again. Intense day. Okay, you can like double flame them. Because that will, because once you flame them the first time, that will stall them. And enough for you to find them a second. Nasty Nork has put one of his most devious henchmen in charge of the artisan world. Bring him on! I think I smell a barbecue. Be careful, Spyro. Toasty has many tricks up his sleeve. Toasty has many tricks up his sleeve. See, like I was saying. He's a sheep. And by the way, I just now found that. All right. 100%. Thank you guys for, for joining me on this little adventure for the artisan's home world. Now that Toasty is done, time to go to Marco the Balloonist. I see you. You may trap. Are you ready to go? We're going to peacekeepers, people. I might as well, like, get two peacekeepers before I end this video. Because, why not? I mean, I still got, like, 19 minutes. So. <laughs> Welcome to Peacekeepers. Hello? First up, let's see what he has to say. Titan. I like Welcome his weapon. Peacekeepers. Look how our treasure has been stolen and turned against us. Please, recover our treasure, Spyro. Collect treasure. Got it. I like his weapon. Like, I legit like his weapon. He can burn. Now, I think there's a skill point. Like I said, I think there's a skill point here. But I'm not sure. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check the skill points. Okay, yeah, I was right. There is a peacekeeper here. Or... There is a skill point here. 
along with Dr. Shimp. It's like every okay, except for Dreamweavers, there are four and multiple trophies. So I'm gonna here's what I'm gonna do. Break cut and dry. Now, when you turn away from these guys, they do that. Yeah. Jeez, die! Why won't you let me die? What? Spyro, Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. I just love that motion. Like, I legit like how he grabs his stomach. Telling Spyro to keep Sparks healthy. And because I like content, I am not going to do any levels because I want that to be in the next video. <gasps> wow. I am not doing what I said at all. I said I was going to end it uh, after Toasty. And look at me collecting more gems. <laughs> ah! But that's really all I can do because I want the content or the quality to be much better. By the way, when we come back, we will be going to Dry Cannon. Yep, you heard me. Dry Cannon, folks. Jeez, I still have 15 minutes. Ah! Sorry, Sparks. I should really stop jumping. And who knows, we might even go to night flight. Oh, I'm just kidding, we're definitely going to night flight. Oh! That scared me. Bunny. See? See? Yeah. Give me back that dragon egg. Cause you got a uh, gunner. <laughs> well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work. Again. And I know fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some. Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure. Again, with his size, I sh I honestly think he should have a deeper voice. I mean, some of them fit. What the? Get back here, you buddy. Okay. Hi. What do you mean, am I okay? Ah! No? Come on, Sparks. <sighs> okay. That happened. So, yeah, in case that happens, you better have sparks up to full strength. Or else, you a gonar. 
You gotta be smart on how you fly, too. That is a must. Ah! Well, here's the... This should be the final chest. Oh, 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 what's this? What's this? We're messing chubs. And I know where, I know where they are. Because that one's a dick. When you're trying to find all the gems. There is one more gem. One to two more gems. Either two red or one green. And most likely it's... Green. Anyway, that's all the time I have. I hope y'all enjoyed this little walkabout through the walkabout through the Peacekeeper. Walkabout through Peacekeepers and our little adventure in Artisans. So I will see you guys next time. Bye. This is Nath. Be sure to like. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and comment saying what you want next. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and hit that bell. Until then, see you guys next time.